As many of you know, recently DreamWorks has been on a winning streak with their animated movies as of late. The Bad Guys was pretty good, Puss in Boots The Last Wish was phenomenal, and now let's talk about their newest movie, Ruby Gilman Teenage Kraken. Like I said previously, I really enjoyed The Bad Guys and loved The Last Wish, but this is one of the worst handled things I've ever seen. Now, I'm not talking about the movie itself, in fact, I actually found it quite enjoyable. It's just the way Universal and DreamWorks have been treating this movie is almost depressing by giving it little to no marketing, announcing a digital release date the day it was released in theaters, and also not giving it a 4K Blu-ray release. I mean seriously, I can make an entire video just about how bad Ruby Gilman's marketing was, but that's a topic for another day. But hey, that's not gonna stop me from checking it out, and like I just said, I personally loved the movie and found it quite enjoyable. The story was decent, the characters were likable and charming, and the world building was pretty good in this movie. But this movie's best attribute without a doubt is the character designs, especially Ruby when she's not in her Kraken form. I mean, look at her. Look at her. Look at how cute she looks. Look at her. Look at her. Overall, I really enjoyed Ruby Gilman Teenage Kraken. It's not amazing, but it's still a really enjoyable film, and I give it an 8 out of 10. Alright, so the lesson of the day this video told is... Stop bashing original animated movies just because they're not Spider-Verse. Not every animated movie needs to be like Spider-Verse. How come you people don't understand that?